Hello everyone. It's my great honor to introduce our work SMART, Sand Mixing for Unobserved Class Detection in Graph Few-Shot Learning. Our motivation stems from the fact that in few-shot classification tasks, it is often assumed that the samples for training and testing come from the same common classes. However, some samples for testing may actually not belong to any known classes in the training set in practical applications. These samples are called out-of distribution samples or OOD samples. For example, some rare cases never observed in medicine could be collected in a query set, or papers about a new research topic could gradually emerge in a citation graph. A conventional graph few shot classification model could mistakenly classify an OOD sample into an existing category, sometimes resulting in severe incidents in safety critical applications. GFSC models without the awareness of OOD samples will categorize an unobserved class sample into existing classes. These models face two dilemmas. One, OOD samples are mistakenly assigned to an arbitrary category, and two, the existence of OOD samples harms the classification of normal samples. Meanwhile, models with the awareness of OOD samples can better categorize normal samples into their proper classes if we can identify OOD samples. This paper presents SMUG, a novel graph few shot classification framework to address to the problem of identifying OOD samples in graph few shot classification tasks. SMUG equips existing classification models with the ability of OOD detection. Figure below presents an overview of SMUG, which comprises two training phases. The first phase involves a common training process of a graph few shot classification model. A series of meta-tasks are generated by sampling from the training set. For each meta-task, nodes in a support and query set pair are fed into an encoder to learn their low-dimensional representations. We employ an inductive GCN encoder for graph representation learning. Then, the obtained embeddings are fed into a multilayer perceptron classifier. The cross-entropy loss is employed to train the encoder in this step. The second phase is our key contribution. The main idea is to mix the query sets of meta-training tasks with artificial OOD samples, which are then identified before being fed into the multilayer perceptron classifier. If you are interested in our work, welcome to read the full article to learn more. Thanks for your listening.